Immerse yourself in the world of Sir Isaac Newton, a genius who forever changed our understanding of the cosmos. A titan of knowledge, Newton's brilliance illuminated the landscape of science during the era of the scientific revolution. A true polymath, his groundbreaking work transcended boundaries, making significant strides in the fields of physics, mathematics, astronomy and chemistry. He dared to look beyond the known revolutionizing telescope design and shining a light on the mysteries of color. His seminal work, Principia, laid the foundation of classical mechanics, introducing the world to the three laws of motion. Concepts such as inertia, acceleration and action-reaction were no longer enigmatic, thanks to Newton's lucid explanations. His exploration into the realm of calculus provided a fresh mathematical tool to comprehend the changing nature of forces and acceleration. Perhaps his most iconic achievement is the theory of gravity, a force that binds us all to the Earth and the cosmos beyond. Newton's genius extended our understanding of the universe, unmasking the laws that govern the world around us. Join us as we journey through the life and discoveries of this extraordinary mind. Born in 1643 in a small English village, Isaac Newton's journey to greatness was marked by curiosity and intellect. In the green pastures of Lincolnshire in the humble hamlet of Woolsthorpe, the seeds of a remarkable life were sown. Newton's early years were not extraordinary by any measure. He was born, prematurely, a tiny and frail child. His father had passed away before his birth, and his mother remarried when he was just three, leaving him in the care of his grandparents. However, young Isaac found solace in the natural world around him. He was fascinated by everything from the flight of a bird to the fall of an apple. His curiosity led him to ask questions, to observe and to learn. He was not just a passive observer of nature, but an active participant, keen to understand its deepest secrets. His formal education began at the King's School in Grantham, where he proved to be a diligent and intelligent student. He developed a keen interest in mathematics and physics, laying the foundation for his future achievements. Little did the world know the boy from Woolsthorpe would one day revolutionize our understanding of the universe. At the age of 19, Newton entered Cambridge University, a place that would become the breeding ground for his revolutionary ideas. Picture this, a young, curious mind stepping into the grandeur of Cambridge, a world brimming with knowledge and intellectual discourse. Yet, little did they know, the institution was about to house one of the greatest scientific minds in history. During his time at Cambridge, Newton immersed himself in a world of academia, passionately devouring every bit of knowledge he could find. In this intellectual hotbed, Newton's genius was truly unleashed. He delved into the mysteries of the physical world, exploring the realms of calculus, optics and physics. His fascination with calculus was not a mere academic pursuit. Rather, it was a powerful tool that Newton would use to decipher the enigmatic language of the universe. He developed the foundations of differential and integral calculus, concepts that would later become instrumental in understanding the changing nature of forces and acceleration. In the field of optics, Newton's curiosity was piqued by the behavior of light. His relentless experimentation led him to a groundbreaking discovery. White light was not a single entity, but a combination of all colors. He explored this phenomenon further, conducting experiments that would eventually result in the creation of the reflecting telescope, a design still used today. Meanwhile, in the realm of physics, Newton was laying the groundwork for his revolutionary laws of motion. His studies in this field sought to elucidate the fundamental principles that governed the movement of objects. These laws would later become cornerstones of physics, shaping our understanding of the physical world. But Cambridge was more than just a place of study for Newton. It was a crucible, a place where his ideas were tested, molded and refined. It was here that Newton's genius was honed, his theories were born and his legacy was begun. In the hallowed halls of Cambridge, Newton was laying the groundwork for a scientific revolution. And indeed, the revolution was just beginning. Newton's Cambridge years were a testament to his insatiable curiosity and unparalleled genius, a period that would forever change the course of science.
In the summer of 1665, a falling apple in Newton's garden led to a groundbreaking revelation, the universal law of gravitation. Enter Isaac Newton's three laws of motion. First, the law of inertia. It tells us that an object at rest will stay at rest, and an object in motion will stay in motion, unless acted upon by an external force. Think of it as the universe's way of maintaining the status quo. Then comes the second law, the law of acceleration. It's all about cause and effect. The force applied to an object is equal to its mass times the acceleration. In simpler terms, if you push a heavy object, it won't move as quickly as a lighter one. The third law, action and reaction, is the one you've probably heard of. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. This is the principle that allows rockets to blast off into space. But Newton didn't stop at motion. He also gave us the universal law of gravitation. This law states that every particle of matter in the universe attracts every other particle with a force that is directly proportional to the product of their masses and inversely proportional to the square of the distance between them. This law, my friends, is the reason why we aren't floating off into space right now. These laws transformed our understanding of the physical world. They provided a framework to explain the movements and interactions of everything around us from the smallest particles to the largest celestial bodies. Newton's laws of motion and his law of universal gravitation were revolutionary. They provided a mathematical description of the physical world that was unprecedented in its accuracy and predictive power. Newton didn't just observe nature, he explained it. With these laws, Newton not only explained the fall of an apple, but also the motion of the planets in the heavens. Newton's genius was not limited to the heavens. His experiments with light brought color to our world. He embarked on a journey to decode the mystery of light and its dazzling colors. He found a simple glass prism to be his key. As he passed a narrow beam of sunlight through this prism, he witnessed a spectacle. The white sunlight transformed into a band of beautiful colors similar to a rainbow. This was the birth of our understanding of the spectrum of light. Newton's prism experiment was a revelation. It demonstrated that white light is not indivisible. Instead, it is a blend of different colors, each bending by a different amount when passing through a prism. Red light bends the least, while violet light bends the most, resulting in an array of colors from red to violet. This was a paradigm shift in our understanding of light and color. Newton not only discovered the color spectrum, he also realized that the colors could be recombined to form white light again. This was a groundbreaking concept, proving that white light is indeed a combination of all colors. In a beam of light, Newton found a rainbow of possibilities. Newton's contributions extend beyond his lifetime, shaping the scientific world as we know it today. His influence transcends centuries, resonating in the works of many who came after him. A notable example is none other than Albert Einstein, whose groundbreaking theory of relativity owes much to the foundational principles laid out by Newton. Newton's laws of motion and his concept of universal gravitation helped Einstein to envision a universe where space and time are interwoven, where gravity is not just a force, but the curvature of space-time itself. In a sense, Newton's work provided the stepping stones for Einstein to leap into a new realm of understanding. But Newton's legacy is not confined to theoretical physics alone. His practical inventions have also had a profound impact, particularly in the field of astronomy. Newton revolutionized the design of telescopes by replacing refracting lenses with mirrored ones. This ingenious modification gave birth to the reflecting telescope, a design that is still widely used in contemporary astronomy. These telescopes allow us to gaze deeper into the cosmos, to see farther and clearer than ever before. They enable astronomers to uncover the mysteries of distant galaxies, to study celestial bodies in unprecedented detail, and to explore the very edges of the observable universe. In essence, Newton's reflecting telescope has expanded our cosmic horizon, opening up new avenues for discovery and understanding. Yet the true power of Newton's legacy lies not only in his extraordinary contributions to science, but also in the inspirational journey of his life. His relentless curiosity, his unwavering determination, his ceaseless quest for knowledge, 
These are the qualities that continue to inspire scientists and dreamers alike. <laughs>